I'm usually really good at being on top of cleaning my space and making sure everything's neat. But these past couple weeks have been incredibly stressful and tiring and I mean, just look at the amount of laundry that I have to freaking do. I really don't want to like, have to like leave it for however long because we're leaving tomorrow morning and Brian's gonna be taking care of Sobel while we're away. So I have to give him the key and I don't want this apartment to be a disgusting mess every time he comes in. Remember how I mentioned that we never know where to find Sobel? Well, I found him today in the bathtub. This is um, actually a play. <gasps> Another play. My friend Marlo recommended this to me. I'm very excited to read it. This one is from Neo Strata. I have an event with them tomorrow. And this I believe is for that event. He's just hanging out with me. I'm sorry guys, everything he does is so freaking cute to me. So he's kind of the star of all of my vlogs. Ooh, even their wrapping paper says Neostrata. <gasps> this is for, the event is for their new Restore Hydration and Replenishment PHA Daily Moisturizer, anti-aging for, sens for sensitive skin. And they got me a full notebook. I'm actually so pumped about this because I need a new bullet journal and I love how thick it is because that means I can fit as many different weeks and months and days. I can maybe even fit a full year in there. Probably not, but as much as I can. Thank you, this is incredible. From the founders of polyhydroxy acids, this lightweight anti-aging moisturizer for sensitive skin gently exfoliates to improve skin texture and radiance. The PHA formula supports skin's natural collagen and provides skin texture and firming benefits. Playing with this stuff. Is it safe for cats to play with this? I, I'm very excited to use this notebook. I'm so pumped about that. And this as well. I use Neostrata products all the time. I still, I went out and actually purchased their, um, like, I purchase their products. I don't just use the products they send me. You know when it's brand new and it doesn't come out? Oh, here it comes. Oh, wow. Wow, I really feel a difference already. Update, um, house is clean, which I'm very excited about. I am still in the middle of doing laundry, but um, that's almost done, so that's exciting. I also forgot that I need to pack for tomorrow because I didn't realize me and Ben have to leave at like noon, or sorry, we have to leave at 11 to be there for noon in Hamilton for this event that we're doing. Ah, shoot! Whoa, excuse me. I have uh, <laughs> a dilemma. <laughs> I say that a lot in this vlog, and the dilemmas are never actually that bad, but anyways, this one isn't really a dilemma. We're just, Ben is helping me figure out like some techie stuff because I have an interview tomorrow. Um, not tomorrow, sorry, on Friday, but tomorrow we're leaving for Hamilton for that event thingy that I'm doing. And uh, so I have to do the online interview from, from Hamilton in my hotel room. And I'm thinking that uh, I wanted to use a better camera setup because I feel like my webcam sucks, my, my, the mic sucks, so Ben's gonna help me set up everything to make it look 
real nice and to have the, the sound a little bit more crispy. Yeah. The interesting thing about when you watch a video is people care more about the audio than they do about the video. So if you have a beautiful picture... Can we, can we picture, have a thumbnail quick? <laughs> There's a thumbnail. There it is. There Two smiling go. people. Anyway, um, if you have a video that has absolutely garbage audio and it's like crackly and annoying, it's like torture. You cannot watch it. But if you have good audio and like an okay-ish picture, it's still okay. People will still go through it. You guys don't know what I'm talking about, but you'll see. Yeah. Tomorrow. Yes. Right now we're going to bed. Bye! Well, Bye. Not, we're not going to bed, but we're going to end the vlog. I'm probably not sleeping tonight because I've got a lot of work to... Me too. I just had I a just, coffee. Yeah, I'm a bit of a perfectionist and being a perfectionist... A bit. Yeah. Things, things are never... A bit of a down. perfectionist and a procrastination. A procrastinator. Myself. Too terrible. Like, the worst combination. That's most people my age, though. I'm not that bad. You get distracted pretty easily, so do I. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, that's the day. Bye! <laughs>